Oh my gosh, I am such a huge Team Edward fan. I love Edward. Go Edward, woo! What the heck is your problem? Team Edward? Seriously? It's Team Jacob. Um, I kind of hate telling you this, but it's actually Team Edith now. Go Edith, but it's uh, Team Jules now. Go Jules, go Jules, go, go, go Jules. Hi everybody, it's your girl Esther and welcome back to the Filterless Vlog. So today this video, is, as as you can tell, is about Twilight and Twilight Life After Death, reimagined. It's, it's the most stupidest book name ever. So just yesterday, October the 6th of 2015, Stephanie Myers put it out into the world that She's having a new book of Twilight with um, the gender roles are being changed up and it's no longer Team Edward and Team Jacob, it's Team Edith and Team Jewel. What type of name is Edith? Like, at least Edward and Team Jacob were okay names. Like, Team Edith, Team Jules? What the heck? I, I, I read the books and I pretty much enjoyed it. it. It was a good book back when it came out a couple of or so years ago when I was a smarter, you know. So I, I read the books and I kind of enjoyed it. Stephanie Meyer is an okay author. I did like one of her other books, The Host. I never li li really liked the, the movies just for the fact that it, the vampires were sparkling and all. We got a sparkle, we sparkle. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. What in the world was that? So the they sparkle, these vampires. It's just, why? Like there's... In the history of all vampires, vampires do not sparkle. They never sparkled before. Uh, Dracula never sparkled. The vampires on Vampire Academy never sparkled. The vampires from Vampire Diaries never sparkled. The vampires from True Blood they died kind of creepily, but they still didn't sparkle. Vampires do not sparkle. The vampires from Buffy the Vampire Slayer and from Angel they also never sparkled. They had a different features and all, but. Each vampire from each movies and TV shows it was slightly different, but none of them sparkled. And if you really wanted to write a, sp a, move, a book about sparkly vampires, it should have been like sparkly vampires that go to show business. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba I'm, I'm, I'm not even gonna read it. The only reason why I watched the the movie is just because of the the birthing and when Bella was pregnant, and that was like the only reason I liked that movie, just for the fact that it, it was really good CGI, and I really liked how they, they did all that different stuff. So that's really why I, I watched it. I'm already having a hard time keeping up with Team Edward and Team Jacob. Now there's Team Edith and Team Jules. This is what I really want to do. In a world where if I would be living in a fictional world, the first person I would call first, first off is, um. Hi, um, oh my gosh, Buffy, is this you, girl? Oh my gosh, I can't believe I caught you. But, okay, um, before you hang up on me, let me just say, there's this really huge situation, and I know how much you hate, um, vampires! It's va vampires, okay? <laughs> That's great, please don't hang up on me. Uh, there's a huge situation in, down in Washington. Uh, there's vampires. Um, they're really, really scary vampires. Bad vampires. Uh, is there any way for you to go down to Washington and, I don't know, like, stick a stake into all those sparkly vampires' hearts? And if, by chance, Buffy wouldn't, wouldn't be able to succeed, the next person I would call is... No, check out this one. Hi, is, uh... uh okay, wh what do I want? Um, can I please speak with Blade? Uh, uh, I, uh, okay, um, there's a situation down in Washington, really big, bad vampires, uh, it was scary, scary, they're scaring a lot of people, they're just ruining humanity, is there any way for you to go down and, uh, I don't know, like, get rid of them? Uh, okay, 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 well, I'll talk to you later, okay, but... bye? And if by chance that wouldn't work, this is what I would do next! Uh, hi, is this the Hollywood residence? Really? Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Um, is there any way for me to speak with Piper by any chance? She's the... Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll hold up for a second. 
Oh my gosh, hi Piper. Um, before you say anything, let me just say, please don't deny this. I already know who you are. I know you're um, a part of the charm ones and I know that you have powers to blow people up and freeze people up, so that sort of thing. Now, now that we got out of that way, is there a way for you to go down to Washington? I don't know, either with Pipe, uh, Paige orbing you down or Leo orbing you down or you just driving down there um, with you and your sisters. Uh, this may be like a charm one problem. There's a huge situation down in Washington. Is there any way for you to go down and, I don't know, like vanquish these really bad vampires? They're really bad. Trust me, Piper, you are, will not like them at all. Um, really? Uh, and if you can't by any chance vanqu vanquish them by blowing them up, um, you can actually, um, I, this is uh, just something that just put it out there. If by chance, like, Paige, I don't know, doesn't get her magical powers in, in shape, if she by accidentally uh, orbs them down to hell. Uh, I don't think anybody would really mind. Great, thank you so much, Piper. If that by by chance would would work, I would just go to him like Mount Rushmore or somewhere really big and famous where a lot of people would know. Listen, right, Doctor, you're needed. And like the doctor would say, Oh, Aldi. <laughs> I would say, Hi, Doctor. Thank you so much for coming down here. I uh, I know we, I'm probably like. Nobody, but is there any way for you to go down to Washington, take a bunch, a couple of these really um, sparkly vampires I would want to see? I don't really know if you would want to. So drop them off into, I don't know, Cyberman. Oh, that, that would not be a good. Cyberman vampires, sparkly vampires, Edward as a Cyberman. I hope that is the most stupidest lie, but I didn't even think about it. So, um, Doctor, is there any way for you to, I don't know, like, drop them off to, I don't know, Dalek? And have them to be exterminated. Uh, that was such a bad one. We, we gotta, like, send them off to, to the Daleks to be exterminated. Yeah, so that's pretty much, um, it's just the most stupidest thing, and that's my little rant. If you like this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. If you agree or disagree with anything that I've said, please comment below, let me know. Share it with all your friends and family who you think could actually get a kick out of this video and all, and all that. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel because I do make videos every Mondays and Wednesdays. So until next time, see ya! Gosh, that was so bad.